Hello my Capricorns, this is your daily for the 9th through the 10th. This is Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs, guys. If you're new, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. And um, hope you guys are doing well today. Here we go, guys. We're going to pull an angel prayers card for you guys as a theme. All right? Earth Angel. Thank you, angels, for inspiring me to be more like you. Virgo got this same card. Hmm. Isn't that a coinkadink? Earth signs here. I like it. Let's see what the tarot has to say for my Capricorns. We have death, ending, transforming. Hmm. I think, you know, you guys have, have ended something here, okay? And um, you've ended something, but there is something that's kind of got you in a fickle mind here. Like you're, you're concerned and you're worried about something, but at the same time, it's like you're feeling like happy so what I'm getting from this is that a lot of you okay you've changed there's something that you brought to like this there's this natural end to something okay and you ended something to start something new okay because whatever this was with the death card was not good for you so now you're in this worrying state so what I'm getting is that there's something this not a source is is worrying about if everything is going to work out the way that you plan for it to so there's something that you guys have started, um, maybe a new relationship, maybe a job, maybe, maybe it's something with the arts is what I'm getting for some reason, um, dancing or something like that ballet something something you have taken like a risk on and you're wondering if it's if everything is going to pan out the way that you want it to um will you you know be become famous or will you be successful in this doubting yourself here with the nine of swords okay let's see why this is happening Why is this happening? It's happening because you guys have ended a relationship with someone, right? Or somebody ended something with you. But it's like you stopped thinking about that and started focusing on yourself here. And I do feel like that a lot of you have like started, you know, like new businesses and things. Started feeling good about yourself started exploring like your true love like dancing singing something of that nature but this is you questioning yourself am i that good you are that good and i think why you're questioning yourself here is because of whoever left you this person probably made you feel like you were less than. 
They may not have told you that. They could have told you that, but they may not have told you that. that. But the way that they treated you made you feel that way. And so now, you guys are still healing. Now, it's like you're moving forward and you'll feel confident about yourself one day and then you won't like the next day. And this person made you feel like Maybe they loved you one day. They were willing to accept your cup. And then the next day is like they were looking right past it. So it was like constantly like this hot and cold energy. I feel like you guys um, endured here. So now it's playing, you know, it's playing with your, your self-confidence here. It's playing with you. Okay. Let that nine of swords energy go. Let that seven of swords person go. Whatever they said to you. However they made you feel, that was not true. That is what the Nine of Swords is telling you. That's not true. It's all in your head. You are the Empress, okay? Let's see what's going on with the outside influences for you guys. Hmm. There's somebody... that wants to start something new with you they feel very passionate about you they're unsure how to approach you possible fire energy here but at the same time i saw it so I have to say it. I'm looking at my um, computer screen right there. So I'm looking at it in the computer screen. So I have to say it. There is somebody that wants to start something with you. Okay. There's somebody that has strong feelings for you. Very strong feelings for you. Now. Hmm. Just be leery of this person. They may have changed, but, you know, just use the discernment of the Empress to determine whether or not this person has actually changed, okay, if they come back towards you. Now, here, whatever it is that you have started, my Capricorn friends, be sure of yourself. Be sure of yourself. Do not doubt yourself. This is not real. You will be successful, but you have got to believe in yourself. Okay? Believe in yourself. All right, my Capricorns, let's see what the advice is for you guys to take you on out of this reading. Yeah. Basically what I just said, be sure of yourself. This is unsure. This is guarding yourself, trying to protect yourself. Okay, so my Capricorns, I will be speaking with you guys soon. And um, let's see what signs we got. Uh, well, energy, not signs. Aquarius, Leo, any air sign, really. Um, Gemini and Libra, as well as Aquarius, Aries, Taurus, um, Libra. Um, I said Libra already. Cancer, Scorpio energy here. Does not have to be those signs, guys. But that's the energy that's present, okay? So, bye now.